Hi, morning. Cornish Chris, uh, welcome back to my channel and welcome to all of those amazing people who've recently subscribed. Thank you so much, it's great to have you with me on my journey. Uh, and also thanks to everybody for your continued support. So today I'm fishing at the Boat and Canny, uh, which is a fishery I've looked at many times uh, on Fishpal and often wondered what it'd be like and saw an opportunity to come out for a few hours this morning on uh, Saturday the 29th, is it, of April? Not sure. Um, yeah, Saturday the 29th. Today is the last day that this beat doesn't have a ghillie and I'm quite happy about that because I only want to spend a few hours and uh, really just to enjoy my day uh, out on the riverbank with Theo and uh, really try to just um, have a wonderful and relaxing uh, day. So um, if you're new here, please understand that I record fishing videos regardless of whether or not I catch a fish. It's all about getting out and having the experience of the day. And uh, I hope you'll enjoy this video. So according to the instructions, <clears throat> the um, the best place to fish, or you fish basically from this boat here, um, all the way down as far as the uh, shield on the other side of the bank, uh, on the Scottish side. And so I'm a bit confused really. I, I thought I was still in Scotland on this bank. It's, it's very odd the way it's all kind of working out, but uh, never mind. Um, yeah, and they basically, the owners have said to fish between the boat and the uh, buttress over there, which I think is the buttress over looks, looks like what's a burn coming down. And yeah, I mean, it's, it's a nice uh, short stretch of water, uh, probably cover, uh, cover it this morning and uh, then come back and have some lunch and then cover it again. Uh, so today I paid £30 through Fishpal to uh, fish here. And I mean, uh, the, there's no ghillie uh, until the 1st of May. And I'm here on the 29th of May, uh, 29th of April. Um, I purposely sometimes choose to fish on um, ungillied beats because like today, you know, bit of a late night Friday night went out for a few drinks um, me and Theo <laughs> had something to eat and then came in you know got in a little bit late had a couple of whiskeys sat and watched a bit of telly you know usual kind of thing I I like to get up to uh, uh, of a Friday night and um, just uh, come rock rock up to the beat a little bit later take my time enjoy the process as I said before I I do I do really respect and enjoy having uh, gillies 
um, uh, on gillied beets, but sometimes it's really quite nice uh, to not be on somebody else's timetable and just to be sort of, you know, enjoying my day with Theo out, um, you know, just working, uh, working my way through and just enjoying it. And also it gives me a, a fantastic chance to do more um, content creation for my filming because it's difficult to, um, uh, well, not difficult, but I suppose I should own it more. Um, but I am um, producing, when I produce a video like I've produced this morning, you know, filming me having breakfast and making a cup of coffee and all of that kind of goes with the, uh, uh, with what I enjoy about going fishing. Um, I'm going to make some lunch later, uh, you know, so um, that's what I enjoy. And that's sometimes difficult when you've got a crowded beat or you've got um, gillies knocking about and, and all that because it's, it's like they just want you to get fishing. And to be fair, that's what I should be doing, is I should just be getting fishing. So, let's get fishing. <laughs> I don't know how I'm not more hung over after last night. A fair few to drink. The life of a single man. Well, one man and his dog propping up the bar. Wouldn't have it any other way. <clears throat> You're a good boy. He's right with me. Right with me, moving alongside me. This is just what I've been hoping to be able to train him to do. He's had a run, you see, this morning he had a run and tennis ball, so. It's like a lake.
Good boy, stay, stay. Good boy, stay, stay.
Right, well, that was a lovely lunch. And now, I'm just going to go back through this pool again. Effectively, I think this, this beach probably only got really one pool. I was just rereading the instructions the owner sent me. Uh, very helpful to fish between the boathouse and the buttress, not the boat. But hey, you know, I covered the water. Lovely bacon and egg wrap. Very nice. Yeah, so back on it again. Theo is on the bank next to me. Over there. After today, I've got um, nothing planned until next Wednesday when I'm going to go to the River White Adder and um, yeah, I'm going over there to uh, fish at Hutton Mills, which should be the next the next video I'm looking forward to it it's uh, they caught 10 salmon in April so far so be nice to I'm expecting it to be a smaller river probably something like the urn I'm not necessarily expecting it to be anything as big as this but you know I don't know It'd be nice to go somewhere different No one around. Right, well, that's it. I fished again, I put Theo in the car and I fished all the way down opposite the uh, the shield um, on the opposite bank and uh, I didn't catch anything. All right, so no point just showing you me casting continuously. So I thought I'd call it a wrap. 
Uh, I did get some footage of it, so uh, I'll put a little bit of that in. But uh, as far as I'm concerned, I've had a fantastic day. Um, great to have uh, the place to myself. Um, I had a lovely, uh, lovely breakfast and also a nice fried lunch uh, with a wrap and eggs and bacon. And I'm really into, or uh, starting to get into, um, different ways of cooking. Uh, rather than just sort of like taking sandwiches and trying to make a bit more of an event of it. Uh, so it was great to bust out the old Trangia stove, uh, the old kettle I used to use when I used to go camping a lot. Uh, yeah, so just nice to, to make things differently and do uh, do more things with the day. Uh, so I thought that was really good. Um, yeah, I really like stuff like that. I, li I like to watch a lot of um, sort of camping and outdoor adventure type programs. And uh, yeah, so it's just, I'm kind of uh, getting a little bit closer to that uh, in my filming and also, or, or rather a nice sort of uh, contrast, like a combination of going fishing, but also having a bit of the sort of outdoor adventure, albeit very tame in comparison to some of the, uh, some of the people uh, that I watch on YouTube. Well, look, if you enjoyed it, please don't hesitate to give me a massive thumbs up. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, then my next fishing video will be coming from Hutton Mills uh, on the River Whiteadder. Uh, so that will be my next video, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, so thanks again for your continued support. See you soon. Proper job.